Tennessee schools are one step closer to allowing guns on campus. Two bills passed a House committee today. They target K-12 through schools and also public universities. Our Rebecca Schleicher is live at Legislative Plaza with more on the controversial issue and questions the lawmakers raise. So, Rebecca, what specifically are these bills about? Well, Carrie, the first bill was aimed at smaller districts. Two in the state don't have any school resource officers, and this bill would allow them to arm teacher volunteers. But even some pro-gun lawmakers said they had some concerns about this one. You make a mistake, especially as a teacher in this situation, and you shoot a student, I guarantee you you're going to get sued and your life is pretty much going to be over. The main questions raised were about classroom distractions, liability, and training. The bill only requires 40 hours of training, while resource officers go through more than 500 hours of training. But despite mostly negative comments during the discussion, the bill ended up passing 7 to 5 and moving to the next committee. Tonight, public university employees are also one step closer to carrying concealed weapons with a carry permit on campus. While UT and the Tennessee Board of Regents spoke against the bill, the NRA spoke in favor, urging lawmakers to vote down an amendment allowing schools to opt out because I to be honest I don't think that many of the public institutions which would opt in to do this and we think that it essentially negates the purpose of this bill that opt-out amendment was a 6-6 vote so it failed that means that if this bill does eventually become law every public university in the state would be a part of it reporting live at Legislative Plaza Rebecca Schleicher News Channel 5 Rebecca thank you